Zebra Snake's Secret Weapon Venom You Won't Believe The zebra snake, scientifically known as Coronella zonit, is a truly remarkable reptile inhabiting regions of Europe and parts of Asia. It's often overlooked compared to more dramatic snakes, but its presence across such a wide area speaks to its adaptability and evolutionary success. While it might appear unassuming with its distinctive pattern of dark bands against a lighter background, this snake holds a secret it possesses surprisingly potent venom. This isn't about delivering a deadly strike like some tropical species instead, the zebra snake's venom is primarily used to subdue smaller prey lizards, amphibians, and even occasionally small mammals. It's fascinating how such a relatively slender and non-aggressive snake can produce a toxin capable of immobilizing its meals. While many snakes subdue their prey through constriction squeezing until they suffocate the zebra snake, takes a different approach. It possesses a fascinating and relatively complex venom that combines two distinct types of toxins, neurotoxins and hemotoxins. The neurotoxin targets the nervous system, disrupting communication between the brain and body, essentially paralyzing its victim. Simultaneously, the hemotoxin attacks the blood interfering with clotting and causing internal bleeding. This dual action venom is incredibly effective for dispatching a variety of prey, from rodents to birds, giving the zebra snake a significant advantage in securing its meals. The zebra snake's venom is truly remarkable. It's a two-stage process that makes it an incredibly efficient predator. Initially, this potent cocktail attacks the nervous system of its prey. This neurological assault rapidly induces paralysis, effectively immobilizing the animal preventing any chance of escape. But the story doesn't end there. Following the initial paralysis, the venom shifts gears, beginning to break down blood cells and tissues. It's a devastating combination first complete incapacitation, then systematic tissue destruction, ensuring a swift and certain outcome for its victims. It's remarkable how much power can be packed into such a slender frame. The zebra snake's venom is a prime example of this. Its potency is genuinely disproportionate to its size. Researchers who have analyzed it have found that, pound for pound, it can rival the toxicity levels seen in some considerably larger viper species. This isn't just marginally stronger in certain comparisons, it even surpasses them. The venom's complex cocktail of enzymes and toxins makes it incredibly effective at paralyzing prey and disrupting vital bodily functions, a truly potent defense mechanism for this relatively small snake. The zebra snake's diet is surprisingly varied. While rodents certainly form a significant portion of their meals, they're opportunistic hunters and errant picky. You'll find them successfully preying on birds nesting close to the ground, small fish from streams or puddles, even eggs left unguarded, and occasionally other reptiles. What truly allows them to tackle such a diverse range of prey is the potency of their venom. It ensures that even when facing larger or more agile animals, they can secure a successful kill. Despite their intimidating appearance and powerful bite, zebra snake venom isn't typically life-threatening to humans. It's a relief to know that fatalities are incredibly rare. However, don't underestimate the experience. A bite from this snake is intensely painful often described as burning or throbbing. 
you can expect significant swelling around the bite area and localized tissue damage, which may require treatment. Because of these effects, seeking medical attention promptly after any encounter is always the recommended course of action proper care, helps to manage pain and minimize potential complications. The fascinating complexity of the zebra snake's venom isn't something that appeared overnight. It's a result of millions of years of evolution, finely tuned to its lifestyle. Think about it, this snake thrives in diverse environments, from sprawling grasslands to dense scrublands and even forests. To survive and flourish in such varied habitats, it needed to be adaptable, capable of subduing different prey species. This likely drove the development of a venom with multiple components, allowing it to effectively handle everything from small rodents to birds. Competition also played a crucial role as other predators share these same environments. The zebra snake's venom had to become increasingly potent and specialized to secure its place in the ecosystem. It's an incredible example of natural selection at work. Interestingly, recent research has revealed a fascinating complexity about zebra snake venom. It turns out that its composition isn't uniform across all regions where it's found. Scientists have observed significant differences in the venom's makeup depending on the snake's geographical location. This suggests these snakes may be adapting their venom to best suit the specific types of prey they encounter, locally a clever evolutionary strategy. For instance, populations hunting primarily rodents might produce a venom with different components than those targeting birds or lizards. Understanding these variations is absolutely vital for ensuring effective antivenom development of one size. Fits all antivenom simply won't be as reliable if the venom itself varies so much. The zebra snake's venom is truly fascinating. It's a prime example of how evolution shapes survival strategies. What makes it so effective isn't just one type of toxin but a carefully crafted combination. It's a remarkable blend neurotoxic components that induce paralysis, swiftly immobilizing prey, paired with hemotoxic elements which damage tissues and disrupt blood flow. This dual action approach maximizes efficiency the paralysis ensures capture, while the tissue damage prevents escape and aids in digestion. Predators often specialize, but this snake's venom demonstrates an ingenious synergy, showcasing a truly remarkable adaptation for successful predation. The venom of a zebra snake might seem relatively mild compared to some of its more notorious relatives, but it's far from insignificant. It's actually quite fascinating when you consider the snake's overall lifestyle and ecological role. Unlike snakes that rely heavily on potent venom for subduing large prey, the zebra snake primarily feeds on rodents and birds animals that are already vulnerable. Its venom is more about ensuring a secure grip and preventing escape than delivering a quick kill. It's a tool for control, not necessarily incapacitation. This suggests an evolutionary adaptation to its preferred diet, demonstrating how natural selection shapes venoms based on hunting strategies. The fact that this seemingly less dangerous venom still requires complex biochemical processes highlights the incredible sophistication of even smaller or less prominent species in the animal kingdom, ultimately. The zebra snake's venom highlights its adaptability and underscores the incredible complexity 
hidden within seemingly unassuming wildlife. 